Hello, my name is Dr. James Picos. I'm a sports medicine orthopedic surgeon with Michigan Orthopedic Surgeons and also the Sports Medicine Fellowship Director at Beaumont Hospital. I'm here today to talk about the Smith & Nephew Intellio Connected Tower in addition to the double flow pump and how it helps my practice. So fluid management is the entire case, so it's very important. We can't really get through a procedure without it. Um, without the proper distension and visualization, you can't really perform your case. So that's probably the number one thing that we look for in an arthroscopy procedure. So on a basic level, a pump is there in order to put fluid within the joint and help with distension. Double flow definitely helps that and it helps my needs because on a dual flow option with the inflow and the outflow, it helps to keep pressure even, it helps to keep visualization adequate, and it also helps with resection. A pump's responsiveness is very important to a change in fluid volume because that can either make or break the case. So as you are doing the procedure, if when you turn on the shaver, if the shaver doesn't respond the instant the pump goes on, then you can have a difference in the flow and also visualization. The other option is gonna be with the suction part of that. So again, if, if too much suction occurs during the procedure or case or instant, then you can get a red out and you won't be able to see the visualization in order to perform the procedure. And a big portion of fluid management is really making sure that, you know, you have adequate visualization, but that you can see what you're doing. And, and the longer you do wait to do the repair, things can insufflate with water. But again, keeping the pump pressure where it's at, I think really helps to avoid um, the tissues becoming insufflated and uh, kind of really uh, hampering your, your repair. So again, the pump pressure is at 70. You know, you could, you could change that pretty easily on the fly if you really needed to. So the negative impacts from a lack of responsiveness really get down to a safety issue. Some of this is when you want to turn the shaver on, if the suction doesn't go on immediately, and then you move from that position expecting the, the shaver to be on, you can't injure another part of the joint. Similarly, on the other side, if you're doing a procedure and the flow is too much or the pump thinks that um, the suction should be higher than it is, then again, that can adversely affect the outcome of the procedure. In terms of the double flow pump, it's really a simplicity issue. It's very easy to set up and also the buttons on it are not too complex. So pretty much any team in the OR can handle setting up a dual inflow and outflow pump. The pump is um, pretty simple to set up. It's similar to other systems that I've used. Um, what I especially liked, I did notice that it uses much less water than some of the other systems. That's important to me. Rather than running back and forth, refilling and spiking bags every few minutes, I've got a little more leeway and it's something that I don't have to worry about quite as often. The Intellio Connected Tower, one main benefit is going to be the connected app that it has. From that app, you're basically able to access everything on the tower, including the suction, including the lighting, and also the coblation from one area. So in terms of the nursing staff, they don't have to be walking up to the uh, surgical area constantly to be adjusting things. They can be charting and at the same time can be adjusting those levels. The ability to control the settings or change the settings from the Connected Tower app makes the nurse's job much easier. They can be sitting at their workstation, they can manage all of the things going on, including the suction and pump pressure um, and coblation settings, and at the same time get their work done. So their efficiency goes up, they're happy that they're not moving all across the room, and again, in terms of a sterile field, they're not near it. So the considerations for my team in the OR are huge, and that goes into the nurses and also even some of the reps that are in the room. For the nurses, you wanna make things simple, you wanna make it efficient for them, and you wanna make it easy for them to perform their job. With the reps, you wanna make sure that they can assist the nurses easily, and that the functionality of the system makes it safe for the patient and makes the case efficient. The Lens Connected Tower app takes a lot of the pressure off your shoulders. 
Rather than managing eight machines at once, I can manage them from one central point all at the same time instantly. So I'm not running back and forth constantly. And instead of my concentration being split between eight things, now it's between three things, which seems minor, but sometimes in a high stress situation that can make a big difference. The Connected Tower app also offers specific surgeon profiles. Those can be preset, so cases can flow between surgeons. Um, if one surgeon comes in after another, the nurses just hit the other surgeon profile and everything can be changed all the way down to the coblation settings. This is pretty important with efficiency. Again, the setup uh, errors are minimized and the surgeon preferences are there so that there's no questions at the start of the case. So the, the multiple surgeon profiles already pre-programmed makes my life a little bit easier. During the case, it's not really a big deal, but preparing for the case can save me a lot of time. Rather than having to switch between multiple surgeons that may be following each other, with just a few clicks on the screen, I can switch between all of them. It's got all their preferences and settings already pre-programmed. I don't have to worry about them. I don't have to memorize them. And it doesn't take me long to switch between them. The benefit of the on-screen display is that it's basically a one-stop shop for seeing all of the options during surgery. You don't have to look down at the tower or even call one of the room staff in order to verify any of the settings. And these would include the suction settings, the shaver settings, or even the coblation settings. It does help with patient safety as these can be easily double-checked at any time during the procedure. The functionality of the system makes it safe for the patient and makes the case efficient.